My new book is a biography of the trade union leader Mary MacArthur. It's called Writing the Wrong and it's the story of an extraordinary leader. She was born in 1880 and did more in the 40 years of her life than most people have in twice that long. She lived her life at breakneck speed, a trade union leader who formed an all-female trade union, the National Federation of Women Workers, to support women who worked in some of the worst paid jobs in the country. Her job was to give them a voice and that's certainly what she did to make sure that their wages were higher, that their conditions were better. But she didn't do it for them, she did it with them. She was on a mission, she had a purpose and she went for it. During the First World War she supported women who in their thousands went into the munitions factories and she made sure that the pay that they got was the pay that they were promised. She made sure that the world was listening. My book is about Mary the person, Mary the politician, Mary the wife and mother. It's a book about a woman of her times. Today's been absolutely amazing. I've spent the whole day in Cradley Heath where Mary MacArthur was well known because she led the Chainmakers strike in 1910, where she led the women in a 10 week strike for a minimum wage, which they won 109 years ago today. So it's a really good day to be here. We've had a school come into the library to talk and ask questions about the history. We've had the dedication of a couple of books to the local library by the friends of the women chainmakers. There's a reenactment of one of Mary MacArthur's speeches that took place here in Cradley Heath. We have a choir who are going to sing some songs about Mary MacArthur and lots of other things as well. I'm so delighted to be here. I think this biography is extremely important. The last one was many, many years ago, 1925, and we need to bring everything up to date. When Cathy mentioned she was going to write another biography and wanted access to papers, I said, you can have the lot and don't worry about copyright, just do it. It's about time and place in history, and quite often our history is forgotten. And there were many, many, many great people, but this one was my grandmother, and I want to bring her into the 21st century. <laughs> The book is very important. What you can see here tonight, the amount of people that have turned out to be here tonight to listen to the story is, is a, a sign of how important it is to so many people, not just to myself and trade unionists, but to people that are just generally interested in, in social history and the story of Mary. I think the new book by Cathy is really exciting. It's a really important contribution to the trade union movement and to the history of women workers. She stood up and she fought and we need that character of Mary MacArthur in our trade union leadership now more than ever. I've got my own copy of the book and I can't wait to read it. I'm hoping that Cathy signs it for me and I can pass it on to um, my daughter who already knows about her chainmaker roots. So it's, it's kind of full circle. And I find it incredibly remarkable what an amazing person she was. Mm -hmm.